This is my cosmetic mod guide to the Nerf Retaliator. Um, first I'll be unscrewing all of the screws. And I'll get to work. Okay, so down here, there is a huge screw that goes into this spot right here. Just keep that in mind. Do not forget about these back screws on the uh, stock adapter. The ones in the back of here are a bit thicker and smaller than the rest, so they're easy to see which one is which. Opening it right up, this thing popped out, so I might have to figure out where that goes. Um, so I would assume it's back here. Um, this is just kind of a reference point for me. To see where everything goes. First things first, I'm going to see if I can get this plunger tube out. So I think all you need to do is unscrew that screw and that screw, and this whole thing comes out. Um, here's the block. I don't think you can get it out unless you get that screw out. So, I'll see if I can do it. So I just pulled this piece out, this piece out. Now, when getting this piece out, the spring will fling out. So, keep that in mind. I can't really get this piece off of here for some reason. I don't know if there's like another screw I'm missing, but like that one. That one's already come out as far as I can really make it. And I don't see anymore. There we go. Let it tease it out of there. Let me see if I can get this trigger and stuff out of here. And it's held in, so. Yeah, okay. So. I'll work on it. See how I can get. Now then. Right here. There's a screw. And this holds in the slide. Get that out. Same on this side. Then the slide piece comes off, along with that slide piece comes off. Now I'm going to see if I can get this out of here. <laughs> this piece right here is actually very cool. Because it's a separate piece, but I can't really get it out. I have seen it in my hand, but that piece. So I'll get that piece out. That, that piece out, and then this piece out, and then I'll start sanding. Okay, so... You unscrew this piece, which is directly screwed into this piece on the other side. So once you screw this piece out, this piece will fall out. And I assume it's the same for over here. I now have the retaliator main gun completely taken apart. There are the remnants. <laughs> so I'll go grab a big baggie, put all this stuff in it, and then name it bag, uh, the actual gun. And then I'll start on this barrel piece and the stock. I'm getting a stampede and I'm gonna use this on it, so. Okay. My baggie. Set everything right here. Move the slide aside. Yeah, 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 yeah. And start bagging. Now for the barrel and the stock. Let's start with the barrel first. So that adapter piece. Oops, it has a spring in it. 
and it goes right there. Keep that in mind, and then I'm going to keep this piece orange along with the barrel. So I'm going to set those aside for now. Then here are the two, um, I guess attachment points. So that's all. Just pull that piece out and it'll be good. Now stock attachment time. I have actually a good plan for this one. Okay, so I'm just going to take this piece off. And uh, I'm going to keep this piece orange. So that's why I didn't unscrew it. If I can get this last piece off. But I'm going to keep this the same. And I think this is attached. So I'm going to keep it the same and only paint this. For two reasons. One, this will match what I'm actually working on. This will also match, um, or this will also keep functionality, like putting it on and slipping it off, putting it on and slipping it off multiple times over and over again, and over time that paint will rub off anyways, so, yeah. I'm also not painting the uh, clipazine just because I like the clear and dark orange, so, now I guess we'll just... Empty in all these screws. Put them in a baggie. Alright, so we'll open them all up. Lay them out. And it'll be good. Here they all are. This is cash money. The C's covered up. But, um... All laid out. And I guess I... I guess I'll get started on sanding. I've now sanded... This side of the stock, and almost these two. I still have to get this caution and uh, warning sign off. I do this one, this one, and then this one. And uh, I've decided what I'm gonna do it with. I'm gonna paint it with is it's gonna be Rustoleum red, and uh, well, just like Kroger Ren. A Walmart brand white pink. So, yeah. I'm probably just going to do the white first and then cover off some layers and then do the red. So, peace. For now. I'll probably start again. Maybe. I'll see. You'll see. It'll be part two. Maybe. Oh my goodness. This is hard. Um a lot on my hands and it's really dusty that's all blue dust anyway I have completed the blaster the stock the slide and the barrel so um I guess this is part two um I guess I'll go rinse them all off and then I guess I'll dry them off and just paint. Now back, um, I have painted this part. Hold on.